Hello there everyone, this is Nega Knight here, getting ready to play Nightingale. So today we're going to continue on with the quests, and I did a little bit of gathering and stuff. I also went and played with the, my new pick, and uh, woo, we got a hell of a lot of crud from mining. Uh, where did I put it all? That is the question. Here we are, I ended up getting a ton of magnesium, quite a bit of nickel from mining. We also got a little bit of iron, but uh, still... So now we're going to get some new clothing. By the way, if you guys enjoy my content, make sure to su subscribe and also hit the bell notification. I do videos every day. They usually show on the playthrough of the games, tips, tricks, helpful hints, and everything else. Now, we're going to be making some new clothes. And my setup is we've got the crude coat, ro the coat rack, the simple saddle rack, and the construction press. Now, since they don't tell you the things on here, I can show you, but I wish they gave they gave a short version of this. Like, uh, they took, let's say, as I mentioned previously, like this one says, tools, durability, plus plus. They can shorten it to that. Uh, clothing, weight limit, plus plus. Hammers, damage, stamina plus plus they can they can shorten it down so that when we look at this it tells us what we get from these benefits but yeah that's the, why i got the construction press is because of the weight limit and then for the the rack he, here this gives me health and stamina and then for the uh range the saddle this gives uh ranged weapons uh gives clothing range damage although this next zone is gonna reduce the amount of range damage we do but hey so we're gonna make the boots and uh we're gonna be using a zazel because this will give us uh health health regen the biggest thing i reason why is health regen titania's crown is gonna give us more health regen and stamina regen and then the buttons here is going to be nickel, which gives us health and stamina and environment. So this is more of my like little exploration survival type setup here. So we'll get a boots. Then we'll go for the explorers because this gives us a tier 2 plus thing. So we're going to again Azazel. However the hell you pronounce it, Titania's Crown, and Nickel. Then from there, we'll go to... You know what? We'll go to Desert Scarf, might as well. Now, I, I don't know if it's possible to do the uh, coding trick anymore, because I want to do the coding and to get myself coded uh, cloth, and for some reason... It didn't allow me to do that, which kind of sucks, but hey, we're going to be healthy as hell by the looks of this, by the end of this. Alright, we're going to go for the gloves, which again, leather, and this. So that takes care of the gloves, now we need the hat, which this here... Again, lots of health, lots of health, regen. And then we're going to need the pack, which means we're missing threads. And then we're missing threads again, so we need four more threads. So, let's get that. Now, I do hope they eventually uh, split it where we can have two different thread uh, fibers combined. I also would like a few other things to be done too like when it comes to making is it over here like line it would be nice to have other options since this is a fiber i wish we could use all fibers not just animal fiber like we could use uh, uh plant fiber we could use metal fiber uh that's kind of some of the things I'm hoping they expand upon. Alright, we got the hat. We need the pack. 
Health regen. Health regen. Stamina regen. Environmental resistance and other things like that. So that takes care of our new pack. And then this shirt. Nope, not this one. Uh, this one, which gives, again, tier 2+. plus. Now, in the last video, I showed how to reach gear score 50 for some of these for your tools. So... I recommend checking out the last video. Alright. Now I'm curious what this all is going to look like. I do need to redo... Whoop, I, I do need to redo my roof a bit. And I am going to put a point on top of it. But I need to figure out how to get it all connected first. So... Huh. Looks like military pants. I'm camouflaged. Woo! Uh, we're losing movement speed, but that's to be expected. Mm, colors are kind of meh. Eh, that shirt wasn't too bad, but that might be because of the other stuff. Ooh! I actually feel like I'm a military person right now. I mean, <laughs> well, although the pants probably should be longer, but uh, hey. All right, what are we missing? Uh, we got the hat, that, 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 and that. Everything is 35. That's great. And our current health regen is over 500. Stamina is 17. Our maximum weight's 270. We resist 55%. Great. And... Not seeing our stamina. Oh, there's our stamina. 135. Yes, that is perfect. So, within a minute, I can pretty much get my... Uh, I can get more, a little bit more than my entire health back. Sweet. All right. Oh, man. That speed's... Uh, I, re I miss the speed. I, I feel slow as hell, and that's only... <laughs> we're losing, like, 10% speed. Oh, well. For now, I think I'll just, uh... Remove these, or extract these, and get essence. I can always, uh, make them again, make, uh, or make a new set that is speed-based rather than, uh, whatever else. I didn't realize that I would have this much, uh, left over. Yeah, the speed makes a big difference. 10%. Wow. Oh. Hopefully I didn't crash. Hello? Okay. So we got the axe, we got all that. I need to make a bunch of few, a bunch of other items, but for now, we'll worry about that later. We're gonna go explore. Which means crossways. Kinda wish I could change the color. I don't mind the pattern, just wish I could change the color. Admittedly, I would probably turn it all green if I could. And nice to know that Titania's uh, crown is green. I might have to look into clothing that is uh, uses all fiber or cloth like that. Rather than animal. Admittedly, I wish I was hoping Azazel was going to be white. Like pure white. Because when you kill him, he turns white. And when he's alive, yes, he's uh, like a multiple colors, but... Oh, and if you're wondering, this here is effectively just a means to farm these idiots here. If you build this far enough and wide enough like this, you can have the these guys all be basically trapped to the point. You can just stand here and just walk back and forth and... Basically, it's free farming of essence every time they respawn. 
As you can see here, I'm just gaining a bunch of essence. And quite a bit, too. So, I recommend building this, at least in the, uh, this area. Now, if you build too close, they will spawn outside, or they will spawn up, or they won't spawn at all. But this makes collecting them a hundred times easier, as you can see. Just a little bit of back and forth. And there's usually three of these uh, things stacked on top of each other. So for, whoop. Uh, for now, we're going to run around and collect uh, these. The gravity is reduced, but you can still die from falling. Trust me. I, I learned from one of my off-camera ex uh, explorations. So that's two. I think there's uh, three somewhere here. Uh, no. I do know there's at least a few up top. I think there might have been one on the outside, but I don't 100% remember. I think there was two on the pillars. I think. We'll find out. You basically, just follow along and you'll find them all. Alright. So that's the two here. There was two on that floor. We'll come up to here and we'll see how many are here. Usually you can hear them. Or, well, sometimes you can hear them. Like that. Oh. Yay, we're completing the stupid bard's uh, quest. So that must mean I've gotten them all. And I just saw a chest I want. Whee! Mine. Alright. Is there something up there? If there is, I can't see it from this view. Anyways, we're gonna go down, we're gonna go check and uh, see if we've opened it. If not, we'll have to look for the next location. And yes, okay, so that's all of them. Woo, 70, yeah baby. Now this place can be quite fun, but it also can be Without end. Interesting. But this place can be of a bit of a pain too. So I think we're supposed to be making our way over to here. And I think that's underground. Oh no, it might actually be above ground. Again, stamina. You do be careful flying through those rock areas. You can potentially uh, die. And you do want to be careful of running out of stamina, which we're going to land and we're going to get on there. Whee! Because, yeah, falling, hitting the ground, going splat, definitely not fun. But this actually makes exploring this area quite interesting. I thought it was going to be underground. Guess not. Alright, anything here we can grab, collect. Uh, we have paper. Too bad I couldn't collect the cloth. Uh, nope. Nope. There's a lot of paper. Oh, tomatoes. Carrots. Oh, we're getting all kinds of food here. That's going to be helpful. I can actually craft some of my things. Uh, sulfur. Well, apparently if you're in need of tomatoes and carrots, this is definitely the location. Ooh, wait, yes. I can actually start making a few uh, other items. All right, are you the quest? No, but you have. S That's kind of unfair. 
she has better outfit than I do. Flux, during the exception. Apologies. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, you. Starting to dread? What were you starting to dread? That's, you're not with Calcarian, are you? Not personally, though. It would be fine company. And uh, spite the sorry hand dealt just now. But pleasures of mine. Da -da -da -da. The acting captain and lieu of any more qualified. What happened? Horrific events, uh, small fleet, three airships, 60 odd souls, follow path, earlier fleet, chasing good word of explorer who claimed to reach had a sky like no other realms had he'd seen to chart the stars, meteorites all sort. Dang it, I want to ask that, but we'll, we're, I'll do that later. Left and starting new, new, almost dozen other after I had not heard the names of. So smooth until Welkin's reach. Pilot then, wheels of our ship in my hands. I could do the steer it, felt like took hold, engine damaged. So basically they got into a thing, uh, uh, they can into turbulence nice caused so many ships couldn't say guess something in the realms meddling with gravity air physics so something's meddling nothing unusual something stranger leading down to knows what but oh, some type of magic certain Sweet. Grateful you could spot the source of all this. Truly underst understood. Might be able to calibrate this oversized balloon to sail through it. They'll not be any kinder than they've been to us. No. Nope. Alright. What am I lending a hand with? I can lend both. Not held the title of captain for long and already longer than I like. Great many tasks to delegate. Woo! Not last of our people. If there are survivors out in the sands, they'll need a realm locker to lead them to safety. Also, a pinch for spies. I'll see what I can do. Sweet! As there is. Might be able to help with before you head off. Should be off. Okay, so what do we got? We have find hope essence. No, that's a side quest. Um, right. I think if I hit J, we can turn on what we want to track and what we don't. Near and dear. Yeah, we'll worry about that later. Alright, anyways. We've got to acquire zinc, shimmering, and quartz. Uh, that wouldn't be too hard. Especially now that I've got Oberon's uh, bounty. Explorer reach, find a way into the, in the well. There's a crash site. Of a wreck? What's that got to do with anything? Oh, Scourge. The, the wrecks. So I got to see if there's any survivors here. Most likely not. They most likely all became bound. Ow. Uh, ow. 
that 10 speed 10 percent speed made a huge difference apparently <sighs> there we go i didn't realize i get those guys were 10 percent faster than me still i got my health regen so we're all right these nests are a little bit OP in my personal opinion, especially since they can basically track you wherever. I'm trying to hit. And my range isn't too, oh, there we go. Too bad. Could be better, but. All right. Near me to you too. Sounds like there's another nest somewhere. There we go. All right. Where, oh, where are you guys? Hi. 500. Still enough to kill. Where the hell did you come from? There is another nest. Where? Oh, no? Where the hell do you guys keep coming from? Is that everybody? Any more nests? Alright, uh... There's a scorpion. Probably shouldn't play with that, but I do want to... Whee! I do want this still. Interesting. All right, well, final moment. Sweet sister. If you guys want, you can pause and read this. I'll probably check this out later. Does that mean there's ore around here that I can harvest? Ooh, what's this? Ah! Woo! He's fast. Oh, I forgot that about multi. Uh... That's, this is also part of the reason why I wanted a lot of life. I forgot those idiots can multi-strike uh, combo like that. Ah, bug. Mmm, yes. Alright. Uh, doors of reserve. Sealed shut. Bane scratch. Split. Waste time. Now you, you can read this and believe so. How many cycles before my light knows peace? Interesting. Alright, so that takes care of the that. So now we need to figure out a way into the well. Whee! Ooh. I forgot there's essence up here. Also, 25, nope. 25, nope. We'll worry about that later. Actually, that could give us quite a bit of the stuff we need. In other words, zinc and a few other items. So, enchant, charge, and smash. That's 15. Practically doubles the quantity, which is Dang it. I hate that uh, counts any strike as a uh, hit There we go Actually, was it?
trees, minerals, head, change for multiple heads, provide greater resource, and uh, essence with the gas. Oh yeah, I gotta look into make one of these as a magicka, uh, based one of these instead. If I'm gonna be using the Oberon's Bounty, which is actually absolutely amazing. Especially when you can just one-shot minerals and other items. Uh, Alright, anyways. So, what do we gotta do? Find... Where or oh, where would that be? So, we already did that one. We already did that one. We have the... Uh, Pretty sure that's where we need to go. I'm going to go over to this. And uh, check that out. Oh yeah, we need to eat. Love having super high, uh, what do you call it? Health regen. Having a lot of stamina helps too, but I need to look for metals that give my uh, picks things here. Whee! Now, admittedly, I think as we progress with higher tiers of these, the range ability of these increases. So we're not like shooting back here. With the agile hands that fate do sway, the unattainable lies but a leap away. Mm -hmm. So we have to leap somewhere. Do we leap up? So where, where is this leap? I'm sure we'll find a jump pad somewhere. Ah, here we are. So I must have to jump pad my way up there. Yay! Alright. Oh! Oh, it must be the same clue. I was about to say... Oh, do I gotta get over there somehow? Is that what I gotta do? Oh, hello there. Yeah, yeah, same clue. And broad you too. Alright, we're gonna jump pad, which, uh, I don't know if we need to go that way or that way. We'll find out. Alright, found it. The question is, oh yeah. <laughs> don't. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I think we gotta go over here now, and then we gotta fly through the door. We either that or we gotta go over in there somewhere. But we Oh hey, there's a journal thingy. No different lightning or bless, no hero alone. If you wanna read the rest, you can do that. Uh, stamina, stamina regeneration, that actually would be a nice one to have. What are these? Pretty sure I found where I need to be. Ah. And that's probably how we get out. Yeah, I think we gotta go through here. Oh, that light is... Ew. I thought the light was gonna be much better than that. Alright, guys. Who's ready to fight? I know I am. So let's see what order these are. 
Sounds like there's three of them. One. Two. Three. Yep, okay. One. Two. All right. Wow, that is a lot of essence. All right, another hope. You can pause and you can read it all. I think we're gonna end, end it here. And I'm gonna probably call it how to enter the, uh, enter, oh, hello there. I think we're gonna call it uh, how to enter this place. And then we're gonna continue off with uh, Puck. So. If you guys enjoyed, please like. If you didn't, I understand. Not much happened. Just running around. A little bit of questing. A little bit of better equipment. A bunch of other fun things. And how to enter the Empyrean Observ Observatory. Anyways, if you guys want to be added onto the in-screen credits here, make sure to subscribe. Once I reach a thousand, though, that's it. And if you guys want to check out other games or see more of this series, check out my channel or check out the end screen credits that usually shows my most recent upload. Yay. All right. We're going to get ready for the next episode. So we're going to let the credits roll out and there we go. Bye bye.